Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Walking Dead A New Frontier. Today we're going to start on episode 2, Ties That Bind, part 2. And one more thing I want to say before I get started is that I actually bought Spider-Man PS4 two days ago and I'm going to try to finish playing this game as quick as I can so that I can get started on Spider-Man because a lot of people are starting to play it and I don't want to fall way behind. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started, shall we? This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Hmm. Another flashback. Hello, Kate. Please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. You're <laughs> Just like Besides, me, except... If they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. Except I'm not a crasher. I'm a pro at this point. I insist, Kate. No, no, no. I insist. Grab this sponge and you're going to be eating it, too. It's what? It's not a big deal. I've got it. No, I know you don't mind, but... I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. Mm. He's always talking about how I'm never around. And then when I'm actually here, he acts like he doesn't know me. It's complicated. But look, he loves you. You're his brother. He's got an odd way of showing it. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? You're married, Kate. Well, My goodness. Well, what about David? <laughs> what about David? Kate. I know, I know. I'm just messing around. It's just hard to say no to a fresh start. Always wanted to go to Norway. See the northern lights. But you'll be jet-setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh, Ooh, shit, quick, shit, run underwater. Shit. My goodness. That was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh. Hopefully so he'll annoying. understand. Glasses break, he'll understand. Not with this glass. <sighs> there you go. See? Much better. What was that noise? Come on, Kate, don't make me do this. Guys! Sorry, Kate, but you're... he's coming this way. You're gonna be okay. Hello? Hello, David? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not gonna give me another well, why one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh, here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford well, I think I'm just gonna stay out of it. Do not want to escalate things. It was important to me. You're really gonna do this in front of your brother? Is that what this is about? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone. Except himself. You know what? You're right. It's none of my business. No. It's not. I'm sorry about the glass. Really. It's fine. It was an accident. Don't worry, I can handle him. He's just in a mood. Trust me, it won't last. And... Back to present day? Alright then.
Hey, hey, take it easy. What happened? They got away. But at least oh, they won't. Mariana. Oh my goodness, I for I forgot. Mari. Mm. Let's let's bury her. Let's give her a peaceful send off. I already dug a grave for her. Thank you, Clem. Thank you. She looks so peaceful. It's saddening. I'm so sorry this happened to you, Mari. This was my fault, Mariana. God, God damn it. I'm so sorry, honey. Javi, thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. Because you needed backup. Couldn't leave you by yourself. I couldn't leave you alone. That's because you're a good man. I'm not good enough to save her. You bought your people time, though. That counts for something. Thinking about leave, keeping the cassette player just for something to remember her by in the passing of days. If I still had that candy bar, I'd leave it in her hands. Right there. Okay, Phil Grave. May you rest in peace in the heavens above, Mariana. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Except someday. Someday far away. You did everything you possibly... Would have been easier if we have a knife. The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? You've seen these people before, Clem? I've run into these guys before. So, yes, Who then. Are they? Please? They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. 
Were you their prisoner or something? What do you mean, Stuck? Were you a prisoner? I got out. That's all that matters. Hmm. All right. They left one of their cars behind. That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. But you won't last but you won't last that long alone out there, Clem. Oh great, a glitch. A stinging glitch. You know you won't last long alone. Well, not forever. Let's just get back to Prescott. Well, all right. I'll say this again. May you rest in peace in the heavens above, Mariana Garcia. You're back. My family. Did Eleanor get them here okay? She did. Though, okay isn't the word I'd use to describe them. Eleanor's been doing what she can. You'd best get over to the infirmary. You made it back. She asked for you. You know. I came as fast as I could. I got here as soon as I could. Those guys didn't go down without a fight. And then... Mariana. I managed to stabilize her. Those bastards did her one favor, at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much, he... got overwhelmed. So when's she gonna be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But she's still bleeding inside. I don't want to lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. Hmm. I... I wish I could do more. You did the best you could. That's what matters. Thanks for trying. And for not sugarcoating it. Wish I had something better to tell you. But I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You may want to find Gabe. He looked pretty upset when he left. This isn't going to make him feel any better. Still. I'll track him down. Well, at least I could do a bit of free roaming. I should talk to Trip. How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected. Yeah, considering. If you'd waited for me instead of sneaking off the way you did, I could have helped. Would have been useful in the fight, at least. Not that you had any way of knowing those assholes are gonna show up. Same thing crossed my mind. Believe me. But I couldn't wait to go after my family. Next time, if there is a next time, wait a little longer, okay? Will do. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you, all of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott, if that's what you want. Nobody's gonna force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Thank you, Trip. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so. I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. Okay, another thing. 
that due to playing Spider-Man PS4 next, I'm going to take a little break from the Kingdom Hearts games until I'm done with that, because I will still try to post three videos a day, five days a week, because I feel like I'm running a bit short on time if I do at least two videos. And besides, I just watched a brand new trailer for Kingdom Hearts 3, which was released just sometime this morning as I'm recording this, and, and you want to know what world they show? They showed the world of Big Hero 6. And I was beyond surprised. I went on a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once. Lifetime ago. It was in Japanese though, but... Luckily, they put in the closed captions, as in the subtitles. Hello, Conrad. Wait, first I want to look around a bit more. Pick up water bottle. Do not want to forget this in case someone's thirsty. I'm just glad I'm getting the Walking Dead games out of the way. Because they recently announced, because Telltale Games recently posted on Instagram that the season pass disc for the final season will be available on November 6th. So I think that will be the time episode 3 would be um, released digitally. Okay, talking to Conrad. Hey, have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands, dark look on his face. Headed off that way, without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice, one parent to another. He had a cruddy day. He's had a really bad day. I can't let him go off by himself. Not right now. Sorry to hear that. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friends seen one in the same situation, I'd fight like hell. Anything we can do to help you out, just let me know. I uh, appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. By the front gate. Well, I just came by the front gate, so I would have seen him by now. But all well. Um, Gabe, Gabe, I think it's dead now. Come on, look at me. Calm down, Gabe. I think I should probably give it to him to remember Mariana. I, I don't deserve to have this. I want to go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. We already did. It was peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? We all miss her, Gabe. We all do. I know how much you miss her, Gabe. I miss her too. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. You did the best you could. At least you're trying. That's what matters. You stayed long enough to do some good. And because of that, I'm proud of you. You were there for her. As much as you could be. That doesn't count. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man. Just like my dad was. But you can't be... How men were supposed to act. You can't be like your dad. You can only be you. You're already a man, Gabe. I'm not. But at least I know it now. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen. I know Gabe. you will. But you have a lot to learn. Oh no. Shit. Get inside! Now! Got trouble! <laughs> 